future Nella future Famer. Nella Famer. <laughs> all right y'all so we are back with another video this would be some duck nails tutorial as y'all can see about a thumbnail y'all was so excited to do these nails and the crazy part is though this is my first time doing duck nails but i've been having nail tips like i've been even made me some press on duck nails like prep them but i haven't done them yet i don't know why so when she hit me like she wanted to do some duck nails i was super excited about it so we gonna get into it so as you can see i'm just taking a shine off her nails um i did clean around her cuticle area so now we just size of a nail tips on for the duck nails and these are the ones i got i think where did i get my duck nails from uh i really can't even remember it was really either aliexpress or amazon honestly and i cannot remember at all because i've been bought them so long ago but i just never used them until now but I'm definitely about to do more with duck nails because they're actually super fire. And this is how they look on. We haven't blended, blended in the tips yet. And I did go in and um, tape them up just a little bit after I blended in the tips. I just didn't show it. Y'all, it's going to be some parts that's in and out in this video. I do apologize. Only because my freaking camera, um, no, my camera, my phone, I kept losing storage. Like, kept losing storage. So some, some steps I had to skip. Um, this right here, I already dehydrated the nail. Then I'm just putting a primer on. And I used the Mia Secret um, priming system. And then as you can see, I'm putting on a clear coat of uh, clear acrylic. Just because I'm marbling with all these different colors. And either if I'm do using a neutral color, like a nude, a cover nude or something. Or a cover white, then I don't use clear to cover the base of the nail. Otherwise, if I'm using color, I am. Just because clear is the strongest out of all of the acrylics and it's gonna bond together with the primer just the way we need it to so that's why i use it and as you can see this how i marble it is not something crazy it does not have to be extra it does not have to be a certain system girl throw them colors on and marble it like i don't make a big deal out of it you know it gotta be so fancy we marble two coats together that's it and um yeah that's it and like she wanted like some sunset colors in the ones that she showed me so that's what we'll be doing and like this color i was using my mom got me this color for christmas i forgot how chalky it was it doesn't it doesn't come down this is how it do like i don't know what's wrong with it and i didn't really i forgot how bad it was and so like it looks crazy right now but of course we're gonna cover it and then the clear once i um cap it with the clear at the end you're not gonna see it but like that really blew me i forgot how like chalky and like gritty it was it just doesn't come down i don't know what's wrong with it but it was a pretty color so i needed it to go really go with my sunset the sunset vibe I was going for so then here's another look at how i do my marble and this is in real time so this one isn't sped up and all i do is literally put a base color down first and just marble the other ones on top and that's how i do it like i don't make and you see me pretty much marble to the left like i mean swirl it to the left or to the to the right to either side who knows but basically it's how i do it so i don't marble just with a in the circle like you'll see me put the color on and then i'll take it to the side but just how i like to do mine my colors blend in better to me that way so that's how it just my little method um you can marble however you want to if you marble in a circle nigga marble on but if you don't want to and or you just want to learn a better to me a better and just easier way of marbling that's just the quickest way to me like don't let your colors dry just put them on wet you don't gotta dry your beads out and like marble it to the side like how i just did with that yellow that's literally all i do and that's it and it's how it looks super cute you see pretty much each color just how i want it to be seen and yeah that's how we doing it so now i'm about to cap them all you're not gonna see me cap them all just because like i told you i kept losing storage so every time I, my camera would start rolling, I had to delete some, add some. It was just a mess, but I tried to record as much as I could for y'all. And we got the basics, like, this is how I cap it. Um, I'm just going to toolbar method it. It's, you know, real basic, real simple. This is the easy part. And then you're not going to see me foul or, um, foul or shape because camera die but this is how they look after following shaping really good apex is there everything looks good it's not about the at the decor and the charms all of that and y'all don't see all of that either because the camera died i really do apologize like i'm gonna do way better for the next video i promise 
I'll make sure all my apps is deleted so I can get these videos up and y'all can see every step and not just some of them or a little parts and bits of it but let me know in the comments what y'all think what y'all think about the duck nails I'm here for it I love it I'm definitely gonna do more I'm sorry if y'all don't like them but y'all gonna see more on my channel make sure y'all like comment subscribe we got videos coming every week tell a friend to tell a friend and this is how they look how they came out fire it was amazing it was junky we loved it let me know what y'all think